welcome all challengers. Okay. Off-putting. Onward! Witness the fruits of my training! It's me. I'm so glad you're safe. Are you hurt, Dad? I'm fine. We all are, fortunately. Though I never thought you would come all the way here to rescue us. We've received word that our daughter has been under your care, however. Class 7, was it? Thank you for coming to our rescue. We are unfit to receive such kind words. Ha! <laughs> I'm relieved to see everyone here is alright. That's far enough. <gasps> Altina! You're the girl with the black combat shell. I count 18 days since our last meeting, Reen Schwarzer, which would have been aboard the Pentagruel. That's right. Did you know we were coming? Affirmative. I received instructions from Lord Rufus to wait here for you. <sighs> really never misses a beat, does he? Just who are you, anyway? That puppet of yours is just like Milliam's. You aren't sisters or something, are you? In a sense, yes. You couldn't be. You don't look that much alike. She would be the elder sister, while I would be the younger one. Do keep in mind that our purposes differ to some extent, however. I don't get it. It sounds like there's more to the two of you than meets the eye. I can't deny being curious about who you really are. Now isn't the time to get to the bottom of that. If you intend to stand in our way, then we intend to remove you by force! Right. And sorry, but we won't be holding back. Green. Be careful, son. I see no meaning in negotiating further. And while I remain partially reluctant, I will rely on the society's contraptions for backup. <laughs> Those 
Those are the archaisms we ran into inside the Weinford building. Good luck, everyone! Please, step back. Black Rabbit Altina, model name OZ-74. Commencing operation. Beginning combat. Support me, Clown Solis. Okay. One, two... And death. Now. I'll set you up. Leave this to me. Delicious. Forming barrier. Too slow. I'll back you up. Let's move. Yeah. Your turn. Okay. This isn't looking good. Blessing of the moon! You have my thanks. Leave this to me! Witness the fruits of my training! Please 
of ignorance and light the way. We'll cut our own path! <laughs> I will- Exactly how it Objective completed. Yeah, I seriously doubt it would be possible to make that thing with modern technology. It couldn't be. Elise! Reed! <laughs> I'm so happy to see you again. I'm sorry it took me so long to get to you. If I weren't so weak, you wouldn't have been stuck here worrying all this time. That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter to me one bit. All that matters now is that you're here with me. And besides, I know I've caused you no shortage of grief by being here. <laughs> Think nothing of it. Holding you in my arms makes carrying all the grief in the world worthwhile. Hmm. Oh, those two, I swear. Someone's got a serious sister complex. <laughs> I'm feeling a little emotional myself now. What a truly inspiring bond they share. <laughs> It's good to see them together again. I'm glad to see you alive and well, Dad. That I am. Sorry to have worried you. Ha <laughs> ha! Look at you! You've certainly grown into a fine young man since I last saw you, haven't you? It... Try not to cheese me in front of the Imperial family, okay? <laughs> Oliver chose well when entrusting the courageous to them. <laughs> Looks like our plan was a perfect success. Hey guys, looks like things went okay on your end too. Indeed. I guess that takes care of the Imperial Guardsmen here. Reen Schwarzer, as well as each of the other members of Class 7, you have my most sincere gratitude for what you have done. We really can't begin to thank you enough. Please, don't thank us. We simply did our duty as Erebonian citizens. Besides, we wouldn't have been able to do anything alone. We only came this far because the whole academy was behind us. I swell with pride to hear as much. My alma mater seems to be raising truly exceptional students these days. I couldn't be happier. Did I hear that right? You attended Thor's as well, Your Majesty? That I did. It's a long-standing tradition that the men of the Imperial family attend the Academy. Oliver did in his younger years, and, Adios willing, Cedric will as well. Oh. Come to think of it... Where is the Crown Prince? Yeah, I can't see that little cutie anywhere. Fee, stop being so disrespectful! Well... The Crown Prince was taken from here several days ago. We were told he was going to somewhere in Heimdall, but nothing beyond that. That's all? That's a little unsettling. If you're looking for the Crown Prince, he's been escorted to the palace. Valflame Palace? But why? For what possible reason could he have been taken there? To cooperate in a ritual. Specifically, Duke Cayenne wishes to use the Crown Prince in a ritual, which will be conducted shortly. A ritual? Where does the Duke fit in all this? Hmm. Sounds like you've got a lot of juicy information you're going to be sharing with us. My thoughts exactly. Fee! Milliam! On it. Roger! <laughs> Stay right where you are. <laughs> you're trapped now! I know little more about the ritual than you do. One thing I do know, however, is that you're too late to stop it from taking place. Just how soon is this ritual?
What's going on? Oh, this is like back in the classroom. <sighs> Where's it coming from? I think it's from above us. Shh. No. This... this can't be happening. Emma? What's wrong, Emma? This song is the Hexen clan's most strictly forbidden incantation. A song to summon the vermilion despair from the deepest darkness. Lucifer lead. What's happening? An earthquake. Its source is the palace. So, they intend to recreate what happened 250 years ago, do they? Your Majesty? Thou art the Vermilion Emperor, keeper of a thousand weapons and ruler of the interval between heaven and hell. As a rightful descendant of the Guardians of the Blaze, I offer unto you this song of exultation! Yes! Yes! That wretched emperor may have halted my ancestor's ambition, but I will grant it in his place. Sorry about this, your highness. Just bear with it a while longer until this is all over. What is that? Yeah! I guess that bad feeling I had was right on the mark. Uh, is that... What does the Duke think he's doing? just as the Black Records described it.
But this time, only the Ashen awoke to do battle with the Azure. On that point, it's very different from before. I can't help but wonder what the outcome will be. <laughs> it's simply too early to tell. However, regardless of who wins, the Noble Alliance's victory is all but artfully displayed on a silver platter. We of Ouroboros will be able to advance our plans, and I will be able to grant my own wish. Let us be going, Grianos. We must guide this story to its grand finale. <laughs> would you care to accompany us, Your Excellency? If you come, I would be most delighted to prepare you a special seat. <laughs> a tempting offer, to be sure, but I'm afraid I'll have to decline. I'll leave the unseen side of this war to you and Duke Cayenne. I'm content to keep watch over the public face of it, whatever ends up coming to pass. How very cold. Well then, I bid you adieu. Whose ballad are you singing with that splendid voice of yours, I wonder? I don't suppose it matters. I have my own duty to attend to. You needn't concern yourself with the castle. Leave that to me. Focus on our aerial defense as I instructed. The crimson wings will grace these skies soon enough. And I want you to be ready for them. Excuse me. My final mission still remains to be completed. Oh. Sorry. She got away. Oopsie! We were supposed to keep her there, weren't we? It doesn't matter. She's the least of our worries now. Just what is that building? Is everyone alright?
land all airspace in three minutes. Let's head straight for Draco's Plaza after entering. Orbital engines and flight engines are both running at optimal levels here. We're ready for combat anytime. I don't doubt the enemy's mothership will try and attack, but you just leave that to us. Understood. Enlighten me on one detail before I go, if you will. Why exactly is Elise on the Courageous? I know you don't approve of my being here, Rain. But please, allow me the privilege of at least watching over you. I won't ask to accompany you like your classmates. I promise. That goes without saying. I know you can use a sword, but not anywhere near the level. Alright, alright, we get it. We know you're worried about her, but try and see things from her side. <laughs> if I may be frank, we couldn't ask for a better way to keep you in check than having her on board. <laughs> for once, we're in agreement. <sighs> Damn you guys. Thank you all for your support. As if anyone in here could turn down those doe eyes of yours, young lady. Remember, there are a lot of people here waiting for you to come home safely. So don't you dare do anything too rash. I concur. You need something to restrain you. You too, Valimar. <laughs> Afraid you're completely outnumbered, Reen. You're not going to change their minds, so you might as well just give up and accept fate. Come on, Reen. You should know when to pick your battles at this point in the game. Fine, fine! Thank you, Reen. And everyone else, too. <laughs> Honestly. Oddly enough, I think that little exchange helped ease the tension around here. There's a break in the clouds ahead. Coming out into Heimdall airspace! Whoa! How can something like that exist? That thing's gotta be like, what, 800 arch tall? It's called the Infernal Castle. It once appeared during the War of the Lions as well. And from there, it must have been sealed away by Dracos the Lionheart and the Lands Maiden. What are they trying to do with it? Look, there! Distance is 2500! It's coming this way! They've activated their gun turrets! They're not even issuing any warnings! All engines! Full power! Land the ship in Draco's Plaza! Dodge any attacks coming our way! Aye aye, Captain! Twelve seconds till we reach max speed! Main cannons and secondary armaments are ready to fire! All crew members, prepare for impact and the effects of G-forces! They'd show up. Looks like Bellamar and I will have to leave them to us. The plan was that we would take care of everything here, and we will do so. Please proceed onward. Patrick, Celestine, we'll be counting on you. Good luck. Loggins. Right back at you. Here we go, Emily. Right. <laughs> As a member of the Florald family, I shall not be defeated. And I will gladly fight at your side, Master Vincent. Let's go, High Bell. What kind of second years would we be if we didn't help out our underclassmen? Let the battle begin! This 
this rate, we might not have to actually do anything. Sounds fine by me. Still, don't you think it's about time you stopped holding back? <laughs> I haven't the faintest idea what you're talking about. Oh dear, it looks like we may have to fight after all. What's the world coming to when a guy can't even have a smoke in peace? Well then, let's not keep them waiting! Now's our chance. Take care, everyone! May Adios be with you all! Go ahead! Right. Right. Begin rapid ascent! We need to draw the enemy mothership's attention! Aye aye, Captain! Way to go, Reen! What great power! Wait! What's that? Is that some sort of spiritual wall? Yes, it's a spiritual barrier, and an incredibly powerful one at that. Ugh, damn her! Whoa! Looks like it's not going to work. If Valimar can't break through it, there's no way Lammy can. Ugh. Isn't there anything we can do? I think there is. Thanks to the Zemurian Ore, I should be able to amplify my power and channel it through my sword. Can you do that, Valimar? It is theoretically possible. Bear in mind, the burden will result in me being immobile for some time. Sorry to ask, but let's do it! Spirit Unification! with Ordeen. Now, everyone, let's get inside. Follow Reen's lead. I'm All right. right. Looks like we're just gonna have to leave everything to them now. Good luck, everyone. Adios, please watch over them. This is a final dungeon. Words seem to have little meaning at this point. Yeah, all we can do is steal ourselves and get moving. Crow and the Azure Knight are in here, right? Yes, and I'm almost certain Vita is too. Duke Cayenne and the Crown Prince are likely accompanying them as well. Zeno and Leo are probably waiting in ambush somewhere around here, I guess. And I wouldn't be surprised if we met one or two Ouroboros enforcers along the way. How are you holding up, Reen? Not too tired? I'm fine, thank you. I foresee several hours of rest being required. By my calculations, I should return to peak condition in time for the battle against the Azure Awakener. Good to hear. Alright, ready to get moving?
This place carries its weight in history, with ties to both the Divine Knights and the War of the Lions. But that doesn't matter. Not now, anyway. All that matters is that you're here, and you have everyone back at the Academy behind you. No matter what you face here, never forget that. Uh, thank you, Instructor. We won't. Well, with that said... Class 7, our mission is to investigate this strange castle and find a way to return things to normal. Remember, we're also here so we can carve out a future we've chosen for ourselves. And if we want Crow to be a part of that future, it's time we show him just how far we've come by being together. There's no turning back from here. So let's just keep moving forward! All right! right.